What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing you a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today I am going to be working as a bus driver. So we got to get going to school here. I got to go get my son ready for the day because he tags along with me on the bus. Good morning, son. Rise and shine. We got to get ready to go for school. Guess what, son? We are going to be going on a field trip with the entire school. I am so excited. So let's get in the car and let's get going. I am going to be grabbing breakfast. Yeah, we are going to be going on the best field trip ever. So be ready. It is going to be a lot of fun. We got to grab our field trip snacks here, you guys. Seriously, you can never have too many snacks for a field trip. So load everything up, son. We got to get going right now. It is going to be a great day. Let's close up the house and let's get on the road. It is pretty foggy out here this morning. Not unusual for a November morning here, you guys. So we are getting on the road right now and we are going to be getting to the school. Pick up the bus, make sure everything is all set and ready to go. You know, my son likes to be the co-pilot. He gives us directions on where we need to go. And he helps me make sure all the students are calm on the school bus. Because you guys know, everybody likes to have a party on the school bus. So we are roaring on the road right now, you guys. We'll be arriving at the school in just a few minutes. And luckily, it is so close to our house. We have a very nice short commute. And guys, we are driving our brand new Mercedes SUV. This thing is absolutely beautiful. One of my favorite vehicles here in Greenville. So we're going to be pulling up to the school in just a moment, you guys. Seriously, it is such a beautiful morning here. Love these foggy days. Seriously, are my favorite. So here we are, everybody. Finally, we are going to be pulling up here. Son, are you ready for the field trip? Hope you got your map all set and ready to go. Oh, brother, you forgot your homework? We're going to be on the bus for 10 hours. What are you possibly going to do? You are not playing your phone for all that time, okay? Oh, my goodness. All right, well, here we are. We are at the school right now, and we got to make sure the bus is all set and ready to go. We got to make sure all of our headlights, turn signals, everything work. As you guys can see, we are always the first one here at work. And we are usually the last one to leave. All right, son, let's get in the bus right now. We got to make sure all of our signals work. The engine starts up properly. All right, let's turn on our flashers. Our headlights are working. Let's give it a good start up here. Perfect diesel engine. Sometimes this thing does run a little bit rough because it is about 20 years old. You know, the district is a little bit low on money, so we do have to drive these older buses. But, you guys, I am so excited for this field trip. Guys, you would not believe it. The students have been waiting months and months. We are going to be headed all the way to New York, you guys. Students are so excited for today. And I am excited, too, for them. So, we are first going to be stopping at the apartment building right up here. We have a lot of our students live here. I mean, it is actually a pretty nice place to live. They have their own swimming pool, which is super nice and they have their own community area which is super cool as well then we gotta head to the neighborhood down here and we will be getting on the main highway for many hours until we arrive to new york you guys my son is getting the map he's getting the directions ready for me because i don't really know where i'm going you know he literally saves the day all the time and literally i cannot use a map while i am driving a school bus of 50 kids so here we are we are finally pulling up to the apartment building you got to make sure that you take some very wide turns here with the school bus otherwise you'll get a flat tire okay you guys and we do not want to have that on a field trip day all right we are here at the first set apartments students should be getting ready to head and board the bus right now i already see a couple students headed outside we've got to put out our stop sign all right here we are we got our first student over here good morning how are we doing today thanks for being on time we appreciate you very much all right, let's get to the middle part of the apartments. Seems like a lot of students are taking the day off here in the first section. All right, not seeing anybody over. Oh, there is somebody back there. Oh my gosh, we literally almost missed him. He was literally blending in, playing his phone over there. Hurry up, please. We got a lot of students to pick up. Good morning. How are we doing today? Good to see ya. Good to see ya. All right, board the bus, please. All right. Let's keep going here. We got a lot of students that live here in the last part of the apartments over here. We got a lot of students here. Good morning. Welcome aboard. Welcome aboard, everybody. We are ready for the field trip. Good morning, everybody. Good to see everybody. All right. We are all set. We got to head to the neighborhood right now to pick up the rest of our students. 
But guys, look at this amazing view from the atop of this balcony here in the neighborhood. I mean, it is just amazing, amazing, amazing. So here we go, we are getting back on the road right now. We'll be headed to the neighborhood and we'll be picking up the last students for the field trip, you guys. Seriously, I love field trips, you guys. They are my favorite thing of all times and they are literally the best thing ever when you're in school, right, you guys? So here we go, I am so excited. We are going to the neighborhood right now. We have a lot of students that live here as well, so we gotta make sure that we do not miss anyone, otherwise we'll probably get some Karens on the phone saying that you missed my son's stop. All right, guys, we are turning left right over here, and the neighborhood is literally right down here. There's about five houses that we need to go to and pick up the students. I hope the weather clears up for the trip to New York. Hopefully the weather is a little bit better in New York. You just never know what to expect, apparently. They just have the craziest weather in New York, so we just don't really know what to expect. Looks like there's some students out here dancing with their parents. Good morning, all aboard please. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are we doing today? Good to see everybody. Looks like we got an extra chaperone joining us on the trip today. Thank you, deputy, for joining us. We appreciate your extra support. We got some more students over here. We will be waiting at this corner. Good morning, all aboard everybody, welcome. All right, everybody please enter the school bus, please enter the school bus. We got a lot of kids running. Last call for the bus everybody, last call. All right, here we go. We are all set, I think this is the last call for students. I am so excited, we might even see the Empire State Building, you guys, oh my gosh. All right, please get in the bus, please, thank you very much. Please be careful, please be careful, thank you. All right, we got all the students here, and we are getting on the main highway right now, you guys. We got all the students. I cannot believe how many students are going on this field trip. Guys, it is pretty difficult to actually drive this bus. You have to take extra wide turns, otherwise you'll hit the curbs and people will complain. So, very, very crazy. So, we're getting on the main highway right now. We will be arriving in New York in about 10 more hours, you guys. So, everybody, take a nap. Relax and enjoy the trip. It is going to be a lot of fun and we are going to set our cruise control on right now. Students are going to take a nap. They are going to read their books. They can do whatever they want on the bus and enjoy the amazing views as we roar down the road. So I'm going to set my cruise control right now and we will see you guys when we get to New York. All right, everybody, we finally arrived here in New York. Oh my goodness, you guys. There is a massive snowstorm on the way. They say be careful for dangerous road conditions. I believe there's already going to be some plows on the street taking care of the roads, but you guys, I cannot believe we are finally here. Hopefully, we can get through the snow. I mean, it is a little bit crazy here. As you guys can see, there's a plow over here clearing the roads, but you guys never know. Some of these plows miss areas, and you know, this bus can get stuck very easily. So we gotta be careful. Some of these streets are really covered. Oh my gosh, there's a giant pile of snow. We literally just went over, and guys, I cannot believe this. We are roaring down the road right now, and we are gonna be headed to the first destination for the field trip, you guys. But we do have to pick up a couple more students from the residential area right down this road. So we're gonna be taking a left turn right up here. And guys, we're gonna be picking up some more students here for this field trip. All right, here we are. Oh my gosh, it looks like the streets have not even been plowed here. Oh my gosh, you guys. All right, we're gonna stop the bus right here. We got a couple more students we gotta pick up. So we're gonna put the bus in park, gotta put out our stop sign and open our door. All right, the stop sign should be flashing. A couple more students are going to be entering the bus right now. As you guys can see, the neighborhood streets are completely covered. Our school bus's roof is literally covered in snow as well. So I seriously hope we do not get stuck anywhere. All right, we're closing up the door and we're gonna continue through the neighborhood. Look at how cozy it is here though, you guys. Um, this is not good. Um, guys, we're literally stuck on a mammoth pile of snow. Okay, we're getting stuck here. Um, are you serious? Guys, we are like stuck here in the snow. This is not good. Um, I need all students to stay calm. Stay calm on the bus. Uh, we may have a little problem here. We're a little bit stuck here. <laughs> uh, just hold on everybody, hold on. Uh, hi there, sir, how you doing? 
Um, you guys might need to plow this street. I'm trying to pick up some students here for a field trip, and we're a little bit stuck here. You mind plowing these roads here, sir? I mean, it is just a little bit crazy. Look at these giant snow plows. I mean, you guys gotta take care of the street, okay, sir? All right, keep clearing these streets, please. All right, guys, we are a little bit stuck here. There's a giant drift in the way. We're gonna have to just sit here until these plows can handle these streets for us. All right, we have our emergency hazards on. All right, let's see. They're going around us right now. Thank goodness. All right, we're gonna try. Uh, get back on that bus right now. Are you kidding me? You want me to call your mother? Do not make me get off this bus. You are not exploring. Get back on the bus right now before I call your mother. Seriously. Five, four, yeah, you better hurry. All right, well, we're getting back on the bus right now. Unbelievable, the student literally tried getting out of the bus. All right, gotta start it back up. Thank goodness the plows finally made it over here. Hopefully we could get out of here. All right, here we go. The bus is having some issues starting in this cold. There we go. All right, you guys. We are going to continue going down the road right now. Thank goodness we were able to get stuck, but you guys, the snow is falling extremely quick here in New York. Look at these giant snowflakes falling from the sky right now. The hood of our school bus is literally covered in snow already. So we got a couple more students that we need to pick up here, you guys. Gotta make sure our door is open. A couple more students need to enter the bus. All right, we got some more students already entering the bus right now. All right. Uh, what are you doing? Have a seat. All right, you know what? We're going to have to leave them behind. Bye-bye. Have a good time. All right, we'll see you later. All right, we're going to continue down the road right now. And, you guys, we are going to be getting to our next destination for the field trip, you guys. We have a long way to go. We are actually going to be taking all the students to a special, special go-karting place. It is known just for students and it has some great experience where students are learning speed and velocity on how fast the go-karts can go they will be measuring their speed so we are going to head over there right now you guys but these roads are actually super super slippery um uh-oh i just got a call this mother's complaining that we left a student behind all right hopefully we could find him in the neighborhood i don't know where he is but he was literally running around playing games with us and we do not play games here on wanny wanny with school bus Guys, I literally do not see him anywhere, so hopefully uh, we can find him. Guys, he's literally running around this neighborhood. Uh, these roads are so slippery. Oh my gosh, the bus is slipping and sliding over here. Uh, this is not good. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you guys. This is actually crazy. These main roads are a little bit better, but we have to go back in the neighborhood to try and find the student. Don't know where he went. He's literally running around the neighborhood like a maniac, and we did say we're going to leave him behind. I think he was somewhere up here. Okay, let's see. Hello? Okay, guys, he is literally completely gone. Unfortunately, um, hopefully his mother will be able to find him, okay? But it is not looking too good. He, he was running around playing games in the neighborhood, and, you know, we do not have time for games. So we're going to get back on the main highway right now, and we are going to be headed to the go-kart place where the students will be able to race each other. Hopefully they're still open. We were not expecting any snow today. So, we don't know if they're actually open. They might actually be closed today due to the inclement weather. So, we're getting back on the main highway right now. The plows have been doing a great job of making sure the streets are clean. And, guys, these main streets... Oh, my word! Oh, my word! Are you serious? What in the world? Are you serious right now? Oh, my gosh, the bus is not in park. Are you serious right now? You literally were standing in the middle of the street. Are you trying to get injured? Oh, my word. All right. We're okay. Stay calm, everybody. Stay calm. All right. We're going to try and start up the bus again. Unbelievable. I seriously am going to have to have a word with your mother after this trip. Seriously. All right. We're starting the bus up right now. Thank goodness. All right. Phew. We found the kid. Well, that's a good thing. Thank goodness they got all these plows here in New York. Otherwise, these streets literally would be covered in snow for hundreds of miles. So we are roaring down the road right now, you guys. And we are going to be headed to the go-kart place right now. Hopefully, they are still open and ready for customers. But guys, look at how amazing these views are here in New York. Seriously, the streets 
and the ground is covered with snow, but it still is absolutely beautiful. So I think the go-kart place is somewhere down here. Hopefully we can find it. All right, we gotta stop at these railroad trucks to make sure nothing is coming. All right, we gotta open our door. All right, it's clear. All right, I think there's actually some event somewhere down here. So we're gonna actually take a right turn down here. We can take a right turn on red. And I think there is something special down here, you guys. So we're gonna take a look. Fortunately, I think the go-kart place is going to be closed. Let's see here. Outdoor skating rink. Okay, we're gonna have to go to the skating rink, everybody. You know, the skating rink is actually open. I don't think the go-karts is actually open, so that is why we are going down here. All right, we gotta keep right. This is the first part of our field trip, you guys, so make sure that you do not get lost. Do not run around like a maniac, okay? All right, guys, here we are at the outdoor skating rink. We are finally here. I am so excited. Now, a couple of our students were complaining because they say that they do not know how to ice skate, so hopefully they can figure it out. All right, here we are. Uh, exit calmly. All right, let's go over here. I think there is some ice skating rink that we can go on. Let's take a look. All right, let's see here. Um... I think it's over here, hopefully. Uh, do not scream at your bus driver, okay? All right, let's see. I think the ice skating rink is over here. Oh my gosh, you guys, look at how cool this is. Well, this is a lot better than going go-karting, let me tell you, because this will be a lot more fun and less dangerous in the inclement weather. So they got some hot chocolate over here. Oh my gosh, this is perfect. All right, help yourself to a hot chocolate. The school paid for it, so drink as much as you want, okay? All right, remember, attention, skate at your own risk. The city is not liable for any injuries, so be careful, okay? All right, we're getting on the ice rink right now, you guys. Look at this mammoth ice rink. This is actually so cool. Oh my gosh. Whoa! This is actually really cool, you guys. They have a giant Christmas tree in the middle. Stay calm, just do not fall down, okay? Guys, look at me. I am literally ice skating right now. This is actually so cool. Guys, leave a comment down below if you have ever gone ice skating. It is actually literally one of my favorite things to do in the winter time. Oh my gosh, he fell down. Are you okay over there? All right, I think I'm gonna have to help you up. You're okay, walk it off, walk it off. Oh my gosh, you're okay. Seriously, let me help you up. Oh my gosh, this kid cannot ice skate for his life. All right, we gotcha, you're okay. All right, well, I guess we're gonna have to go back to the bus because he's already whining and complaining. Oh my goodness. Well, we're gonna go. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Are you okay? Oh my gosh. Oh my word. He literally slammed into the fence. Are you okay? Let me help you up. Let me help you up. You're okay. You're okay. Oh my gosh. Let's get off the ice here. It is actually extremely slippery. What in the world? He literally slammed against the fence. All right. Let's get you back on the bus. I think we need to wrap you up in a bubble suit so you don't get injured at all. All right, unbelievable. I seriously could not believe this. All right, the other students said that they did not want to go ice skating, so they are just waiting in the school bus right now and making sure that nobody takes anything off of our school bus. So we're gonna get back on the road right now, you guys. I mean, we are enjoying this beautiful winter wonderland that is here in New York, guys. This has been one of the best field trips that we have ever had besides the student getting lost, almost hit by the bus, and falling on the ice ring. Everything else has gone very well. So find your seat, please. Uh, excuse me, out of the driver's seat right now. Right now. No, you are like five years old. Now move it. Oh my goodness. All right, everyone else in the bus is not having your attitude today. All right, let's go right now. We are going to be getting on the road right now and we are going to be headed to explore the town a little bit more, you guys. There is some more um, explorations that we want to do. So everybody, please stay seated in the bus. We're gonna be getting back on the road right now and we are going to be enjoying the beautiful, beautiful views of New York, you guys. So make sure you guys are taking notes for your assignment. You need to make sure that you have learned something from your trip, maybe to learn how to ice skate, maybe to enjoy the beautiful weather in New York and you know make sure to watch the news because we were not prepared for any sort of snowstorm because our bus literally got stranded in the middle of nowhere so we are roaring down the road right now you guys oh my gosh guys this is actually extremely slippery oh oh my gosh um are you serious you literally just shook the steering wheel. We are literally stuck in the snowstorm now. Are you serious right now? 
I am going to call on the radio. Guys, we need to have an emergency exit on the bus, please. Everybody exit the bus immediately. There is branches through the roof. Get out of the driver's seat. Everybody exit right now. Everybody exit immediately. We are going to be going through the emergency exit. Oh my gosh, I am too tall to go through the emergency exit. Open the door, open the door. I cannot fit through the emergency exit. Open this front door, hurry up. Oh my gosh, guys, I cannot believe this. Our bus is literally stuck in the middle of the snow right now. And it has been a crazy, crazy field trip. Thank goodness we have a great student to help us out here. So, I mean, these road conditions are extremely icy, so we gotta be careful. So I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.